Ferry docks. It's a beautiful day here. Just make sure. You see, not very busy at all. I would like to get a view of the ride from the lake, but there's too much glare, I think, from that side. So we'll have to do that another time. I kind of hesitated to from where I started from, but it wasn't far from where I started from. I'll try my, see what we can do here. Hopefully we can get a full ride in. Orange Theory. It's a little bit more expensive than your usual workout places, but they have more like uh, classes. One of my, I'm not a member, but one of my friends is, she says, for the most part, pretty fantastic. They have um, more classes. All right, moving again. As we turn onto Bathurst, south onto Bathurst. Bishop, or if you want to go to the lake, thankfully a nice clear view, hardly any glare at all, and the next time I ride this streetcar, I'll get it uh, from the lake, lake view. I like to do when I'm on a streetcar is I like to uh, pay attention to doesn't always happen like I didn't on our way on my way to the exhibition but from now on the rest of this ride I'm gonna pay attention to how many people tap their presto card and it'll be interesting to see if we can see any fare inspectors um, I, ever since they've gone uh, the fair the TTC fare inspectors ever since they've gone back to uh, issuing tickets. I've yet to see any um, on the same streetcar that I'm on. So we'll see as we approach Spadina. The subway over there and the Starbucks. That Starbucks over there actually has a safe injection needles in the washroom. You don't normally see that, but I guess they feel they need it over here. It's a beautiful day, downtown Toronto, taking a ride on the 509 harbor front, making its way to Union Station, although I'll be getting off at Queen's Key Ferry Docks. And you can see people enjoying the outdoors there, the Starbucks. It's always a little awkward whenever there's a stop There we go, we're moving again. So this is gonna be a pretty short streetcar ride. But short and sweet. There's a 510 Spadina streetcar headed north towards Spadina Station. Thankfully 
Luckily, we got a pretty clean window. I don't see any specs there. And as I mentioned, there's a TTC wheel trans moving those that those folks that with the mobility needs and. And uh, the next time I ride this streetcar, do a streetcar ride, I'll definitely get a view of the lake. Next stop, Ray Street. We'll have to be strategic in doing so to make to uh, ward up the clear because right now, not to mention that the window is all scratched up. There's CN Tower and the Sky Dome. Now I'm glad. Um, I did the recording. I was almost not going to do it. Otherwise, if I started from the beginning, it would have been at Strawn. At Strawn. But I'm probably going to end the video right before we get into the tunnel because. Um, I don't want to say it's pointless, but when you're in the tunnel, you're not really seeing anything. All you're seeing is reflection. So, right before we head into the tunnel, I'm gonna end the ride. But hopefully you enjoy this ride. You can see people out there enjoying our summer-like day today. Right, here we go, we're moving again. Next stop, Hyperfront Center. Swish LA, we just passed by. We have to um, do a, a live stream of Swish LA. I'm a fan of the rotisserie style chicken, especially on the, um, the skin, and I'm a big fan of the gravy. I always order an extra cup of gravy, and I just slurp it down. How nice it must be to live right by the waterfront, right by the lake here, as we just passed Lower Simcoe. Shatter Abbas. Always the awkward part here, trying to when things are moving again. You can see traffic right now doesn't look too bad. Doesn't look too bad right now, but it is before rush hour and it is Friday. Um, traffic tends, tends to be uh, a little bit lighter on Fridays. Again, one of the awkwardness here trying to hold. I'm trying not to trying to get as, as much as footage as possible without having to keep starting and stopping. Is there another Starbucks Next over there? Stop, Queens Key Station, Toronto Alum Ferry. Just passing um, Queens Key and York, and you can see um, they're working on the Love Park, and that could very well be done sometime this year. It'll be very, very interesting to see how it turns out. There's RBC Water Park Place, 
and I was I kept raving about how fantastic the Wi-Fi is there but when I was there this morning um, actually the Wi-Fi uh, didn't even work oh that's cool look at the uh, aroma espresso got that and we were heading to the tunnel I hope you enjoyed this streetcar ride my wonderful friends